All right, so we're looking at convection currents. We've got the hot plate here. We have the water. We have the ice layer on the top, hopefully creating a nice little difference in temperature. The hot plate is set at 135 degrees Celsius, and hopefully we can see some convection. Well, let's add some more ice in here, just nice and quickly. Keep this, this layer nice and cold. There we go. All right, let's see what happens. We add in our lovely dye, this beautiful purple. Let's see what happens, all right? So guys, we're watching for convection. Hopefully we see the dye show the movement and flow of the water through the beaker, and we hopefully cannot get, yeah, yeah. See, we got there, is it flow, it there we go, there we go. We got some flow, we got some flow. I was doing this lab demonstration with now ice on the top in this foil layer with different students throughout the day and different colored dyes trying to look at the convection currents that are formed between the hot and cold surfaces and trying to recreate and apply what happens in the asthenosphere in the Earth's interior, how we get these convection currents that move the lithosphere and create plate tectonics. And of course, some demos were more effective than others.